lot to break down there. All right, Eric, thank you for that report. We'll be following that story very closely. The Indiana Court of Appeals is deliberating, is deliberating a preliminary injunction against the state's near total abortion ban. That ban still in place tonight. This is one of several lawsuits the ACLU has brought against the state ban. And this injunction only impacts certain groups. CBS 4's Hannah Adamson tuned in to today's hearing. She joins us now to share key arguments from both sides. Good evening, Hannah. Good evening. The appeal from the defense comes more than a year after the Marion County Trial Court issued that injunction against the ban. That injunction was issued in September 2022 after the ACLU filed a class action lawsuit claiming the ban violated Indiana's Religious Freedom Restoration Act or RIFRA. The defense argues the state has a compelling interest to protect a fetus's development at all stages and that the ban is religion neutral. On the questions of substantial burden, RIFRA requires a showing that the person's religious exercise has been or is likely to be substantially burdened, not that a burden is possible. They've changed their sexual practices to avoid becoming pregnant. They're, they're being substantially burdened today because of this law, which is counter to their religious beliefs. A statement from the attorney general's office reads in part, quote, we once again stood up for the rights of the most vulnerable today. We look forward to the court's ruling on this matter. Reporting in studio, Hannah Adamson, CBS 4 News.